Okay, there's a few wee improvements to the model today, but um, there's more planned. On the feet, a um, bit of stabilization forward to back, so that you're not just relying on the tensioning vertically there. You can hold the whole situation a wee bit more solidly. On the, the top sides, I've got these panels set to the front, um, just the backs edges are shortened. The problem in the logic is happening these five panels at the front left here. They don't seem to be following the standard rule so I'd watch for that. Um, not really a lot else changed. Up. Oh the back net is, is shortened so it um, doesn't interfere so much with the sway but in order to get this swaying motion up and down what I intend to do next is use two sets of catenaries up here, shorten one and add complete panels instead of lots of slotted panels. There's not too much difference in the width between there and there, so I'm thinking you wouldn't have too much wasted if you had a solid panel all the way up there. Drop down the next panel, uh, or raise, sorry, and um, have the elastics between the two catenaries that follow there. Still get your control ones underneath. It might be worth investigating um, where these ribs join on having a similar thing happen on two the lines here so you join these orange ones so you could pull the whole set together coming down onto the control set there I um, hope that makes a bit of sense so you join that 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 across the way down onto its corresponding red uh, to pull the fins sideways or not on there now if I'm using whole sheets I'm going to have to have gaps, uh, avoid kind of gaps up the back so that steering would be able to take place and you could pull one part across the other. I think I'll have a look when I get there. It's getting slightly complex.